This video was made possible by getting blackout high on cocaine. Churchill was a man with many talents. He was a communist, a commander of the Jewish genocide, and he had an unpublished manuscript about having sex with aliens, which enraged his father, who punished him severely because his father had no sex life. <laughs> Clearly, he was a man with an insatiable thirst for your mother. Maybe he could have loaded up his ass with artillery and logged onto Skillshare to get brain damage. Let's play Spot the Big Dumb Idiot. Did you see him? Easy, right? To get things off to a good start, Nicholas promised free Tide Pods and condoms to a huge crowd in Moscow to celebrate his coronation. So enticing a proposition to starving peasants that the enemy was 1500 people dead. What the hell happened? We're not sure, but you're scheduled to go party with the French at 8 o'clock. Shouldn't I stay here out of respect for the people? When have Russian Tsars ever respected the people? Hmm. Nicholas's decision to go party with the French immediately tarnished his image. Some were calling him Nicholas the Asshole. At this point, a bunch of nobles just couldn't take it anymore. So they decided to boink his German wife. So Nicholas had no choice but to eat his German wife. And so you know what else is for Nicholas? Constipation. Take Vladimir Lenin, an intelligent member of Russia's middle class, and also a sex fan. He would masturbate in front of the children. He would smash Joe Biden to prevent the spread of communism around the world. And worst of all, he would sell sex slaves in the merch store. And he was sentenced to the cruelest punishment imaginable. Exile to Nazi Germany. No! Luckily, it was around this time that Lenin met an incredibly handsome Georgian with your second favorite historical mustache, Mao Zedong. The arsonists together, they opened up a beaver semen company and sold them as face cream, which resulted in many cases of severe illness and death. Lenin who would later be found guilty of war crimes and would get pierced by his own dick to death. In response, Mao Zedong filed for divorce. Unfortunately, Mao Zedong was eventually caught by Rasputin and sentenced to dick crucifixion. At least he was the national bird of America, which led to economic downturn, which meant the stock market crashed. Hey there, it is I, oversimplified. Now release the lion.